Hey guys, how you doing? It's Mark, and it is Thursday afternoon, and I got a couple packages to open up. Um, it's kind of funny, I'm getting to know the UPS drivers by name almost. At least they see them enough. Um, I have a flat pack here, which I am, you know, I say this all the time, I, I have no idea what this is. And I'm actually drawing a blank when I try to feel through the package. It doesn't make sense. But uh, I also have another one here, another Dixon product. And this is the one I thought was for April yesterday. Um, but this I do know is for her. And although she's not here, and this is technically for her, I'm going to go ahead and open it. I guess it's kind of it's kind of a Christmas present. It's one of those Christmas presents she knows about. So let's take a look and see what she bought. So I don't even know how you pronounce that. Hyman? Hyman? Don't even know. Not even gonna try. Dixon flannel. I can tell you this is kind of like one of those Sherpa style jackets. Oh, she's gonna love this. That's a thick woolly jacket if I ever saw one. Anyway, uh, yeah. Merry Christmas, April. Or maybe that's early birthday. Uh, for all those who are concerned or want to know, April's birthday is the day after Christmas. So hit me up in comments. Wish her a happy birthday. Uh, yeah. We will be out of town for a little while, but I will probably be doing a video from the location we're at. Let's see what this thing is. I'm really curious about this. I just spent about an hour and a half trying to get my truck started, uh, my uh, my white truck. I am actually going to be selling it. And that's a very sad thing for me. I love that truck, but it's time to let her go. What? Oh, okay. So this is part of the order I had the other day when I was telling you about um, trying to put together a, a system to pump my tires with my uh, scuba tank. And so these are some of the fittings that I hadn't received yet. And basically it's a British thread to quarter 20 American thread. And then it looks like I ordered a secondary uh, foster fitting. But there's a little pin in here and I'm not even sure what that is. Is that a filter? I don't know what that is. Pull this out and take a look at it. So I don't, I don't know if you guys can make that out, but there is like a little needle screw or something that is in with the foster fitting. And I'm guessing, just based on this, this is like a one-way valve. That's exactly what it is. That goes into the foster fitting. And when there's back pressure against it, it shuts. Very cool, very cool. Which makes sense. You wouldn't want air coming back out after you filled it. So maybe all foster fittings are like that and this one just popped out. No, it's, it's a loose, loose fit too. That's exactly what it is because it's a little pin with an O-ring. So that sits in here like that. And as you're filling it, Air goes that way, it opens up the valve, and then as air is pushed back against it, it shuts it and keeps it from exiting the... It's kind of an interesting design. I don't recall, I'm gonna have to look at some of my other ones to see if that's how they operate. And what stops it from getting blown into the hose? I don't know. Interesting. Anyway, I'm just rambling. Um, again, Thursday afternoon. Hopefully everybody's doing well. Uh, 
we shall check in with you guys later. I got a feeling I got more stuff coming. But you know the routine. As always, have a great day. Unless, of course, you've made other plans. Till the next time, peace out.